planning ahead is something we all plan to do, right? But a lot of times it can be difficult. I'm here to tell you that planning ahead with your email marketing calendar can make your life so much better in so many ways. Something we do with clients, but I talk to people all of the time who are either running the business by themselves, maybe they're just starting, um, or people are just looking for some advice. And what I, one of the things I tell them is that you definitely should have a marketing calendar. I don't care if it's in Google Calendar, um, you're using uh, Notion, um, you know, Google Docs, whatever it is that you might be using. But doing that and starting to plan ahead because it not only relieves the burden of this like kind of feeling like you're on the hamster wheel with, you know, email and social media posts and all of that, but it also sparks those ideas and you start seeing things ahead of time. So instead of, you know, oh no, uh, Valentine's Day is coming in February, um, I've just got to do this. Or maybe you can start to see where things tie in together or chances for some different promos. Um, it really does open up some opportunities um, and reduces the stress and the output uh, is also a lot better. So a lot of times um, what I would recommend to people to do is do something that's sustainable. And what I find works well is if you can plan once a month uh, and take 30 minutes at most um, and start looking like two months ahead and just use that same tool, whatever you're using, you know, maybe you have a dedicated um, sub calendar and Google calendar again, or, you know, notion or whatever it is, but you just go in and you set a timer 30 minutes and you start saying, okay, what do I want to do? Are you sending weekly emails? Okay, great. What are you going to talk about? Is it going to be based on a blog post? Are you going to do something based off social media? Are you going to focus on a product and just lay that out at that point? You're not going in and writing. You're not getting detailed. You may say, oh, you know what? Uh, we haven't talked about this product and it's relatively new. We did a launch, but then we haven't followed up. Okay. Let's talk about that, uh, on that day. Boom, moving on to the next email. Maybe you've got some promos. Is there a holiday coming up? Outlining what that looks like. So again, you can do this in 30 minutes or less and it makes your life so much easier. You can then take that, hand it off. You've got a team, have them start writing it up. They'll appreciate it because it's gonna be done well ahead of time uh, and then gives people time to design, edit, change stuff. Um, will really work out. And again, the results are better from this. You start seeing other opportunities uh, and things just work much more smoothly. So hopefully you can put this into work for yourself. I also talk about this in my email marketing book. Uh, you can grab that on Amazon if you're interested. And if you'd like help with your e-commerce email marketing, you can get in touch with me, Adam Moody at oasisoptimization.com.